Shadow, relax, stop, Shadow. Shadow, stop. Woo! Shadow, stop. Relax, Shadow. Woo! Shadow, get off of him. Shadow, stop. Get off of him. Shadow, relax. Get off the man. Get off the man. Shadow, stop. Get off of him. What's wrong with you? You crazy. You are fucking crazy. Well, there you go. What's going on, party people? What is going on? It's your ride chair extraordinaire, your super duper Uber drivers here, guys. Thank you. Thank you. You far too kind. You guys, you already know the deal. Before you hop in my ride, do me a quick favor. Hit that like. Hit that subscribe. Por favor. <laughs> Come on. Let's do this. Hop on in. Buckle in. And let's go. Yeah! Okay, doke, party people, welcome back. And if you're new to my channel, thank you for hitting that subscribe button. What are we talking about today, folks? What are we talking about today? Man, oh man, last night we had the State of the Union address from Sleepy Joe. <laughs> and hopefully, hopefully this will be his last State of the Union address. I don't want to see him anymore, all right? Hopefully we get Donald J. Trump to do the next one, because this is ridiculous. This State of Union address was fiery. I mean, somebody told him he needs to amp it up and be energetic. Instead of being energetic, he was all rah, 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 old man, old man energy. Just get off my lawn type shit. <laughs> America stood strong. And democracy prevailed. We stopped you 50 times before it will stop you again. I say stop it. Stop it, stop it, stop it. Send me the border bill now. We cut the federal deficit by $160 billion. Those bragging about overturning the road we wait have no clue. When America gets knocked down, we get back up. We keep going. That's America. God bless you all. To the everyday hardworking Americans that just heard that speech, I'm sure you feel gaslit and lied to. I didn't know what was gaslighting meant until Joe Biden became president. I heard of the word before, but I didn't know what it meant. This guy is the gaslighter in chief. This guy is the... Inflation? What inflation? You know? Murder rate? What murder rate? I kept America safe. All Americans deserve the freedom to be safe. And America is safer today than when I took office. Year before I took office, murder rates went up 30%. 30% they went up. The biggest increase in history. It was then, through, no, through my American Rescue Plan, which every American voted against, I'm mad at. Yep, yep, Gold Star Dad had to be escorted out. They put him in handcuffs. You know, you can't do that. What? And, you know, you can't disagree with Biden's administration. If you blurt it out, you don't get arrested. Instead, his commander-in-chief chose to use him as a pawn so he could meet his September 11th deadline and get the optics he wanted and never honor my son or his brothers and sisters for their sacrifice for his picture. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. Biden, 13 Marines were killed in Afghanistan when you was pulling them out and you left all the weapons and toys over there for the bad guys to take over. I forgot about that. Shout out to the gold star dad. My condolences to you. I'd be a winner, not really. I... Lincoln, Lincoln Riley, an innocent young woman who was killed. And let's not forget about Lincoln Riley, the football coach who got murdered by an illegal. What? Is that what we're talking about, Biden? No, it's another flub. Lincoln Riley, say her name. You can't even get that right. It was on a button and you still couldn't get it right. Let's go. For many, the American dream is out of reach. For others, like Lake and Riley, the American dream has been completely snuffed out. Lakin's life matters, but you won't hear that from the propagandists in the mainstream media. 
I refuse to sit idly by and allow the fake news to downplay the tragic death of Lakin, a motivated nursing student taken from this world far too soon at the hands of a crazed man from Venezuela who should have never been in our country to begin with. And of course, you see Nancy Pelosi, the only problem she had with the speech is that he said illegal aliens instead of saying undocumented. Never mind the gaffe of not pronouncing Lake and Riley names correctly. She had a problem with illegal aliens. <laughs> Come on. Now, you should have said undocumented, but I, that's not a big thing, okay? What, what's the big thing yeah, about no, that? No, 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 I, was, I, I, I actually wasn't even going to ask about that. I was just going to ask more about the moment. But you do think that he should have said undocumented? That wasn't going to be my question. Well, we usually say undocumented. Uh -huh. He said it. By an illegal. That's right. Did you see the slip when Joe Biden called the migrants, the newcomers, illegal immigrants? Did you just catch that? Or what about when he said this? But how many of the thousands of people being killed by illegals? I don't know how many thousands have been killed by illegals, Biden. Don't you keep track of this? You let them in. I've made sure that the most advanced American technology can't be used in China, not allowing to trade them there. Um, I don't know, Biden. I saw an iPhone here made in America, and I saw one in China. What do you think I should buy? We're going to buy American. We're going to buy American. Okay. So trade rules. Buy American has been the law since 1933. Okay, okay. Makes sense, makes sense. So what about the electric grid? You know, we had forest fires in California. What are you going to do about that? New electric grids that are able to weather major storms and not prevent those fire, forest fires. Uh, what an idiot. When we saw Joe Biden there, really, it was an unhinged madman who uh, has an alternate view of reality. And in fact, it was quite remarkable to me that the mainstream media seemed to give Joe Biden some sort of participation trophy simply because he could stay up that late. <laughs> Honestly, I am surprised that Joe Biden made it through the two hour speech, you know. So I will give you a round of applause for that. You did it, old man. You stood there. You said your speech, you had some moments there, you fell off the rails, you had some people, some trolls out there, Margaret Green, shout out to you, the gold star dad, shout out to you, you know, but you stood there, I thought you was going to fall apart, but you made it through, so, <laughs> you surprised me, sir, you did surprise me, Jesus Christ, anyway, that's the thoughts for the day. If you guys got any value of my content, do me a favor. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe. You see that notification bell? Turn on that notification bell so you get my latest and greatest. Share this content with your best friends. And tell your mama I said hi. <laughs> all right, all right. Until next time, guys, I'll see you again. And all you knuckleheads, get off my lawn.